We've all had an amaretto sour before, but today on Let's Talk Drinks, I'm going to make what has been called the best amaretto sour in the world. Okay, the best amaretto sour in the world. What a big call. Uh, and it's not from me. This drink is made by a fella by the name of Jeffrey Morgenthaler uh, in the US, and he's making these 80s cocktails, just he's recreating them and just making them Mickey Mouse. And uh, he's done a really great job with this amaretto sour. I am a fan of amaretto sours, but uh, he has taken this to the next level. So the first ingredient, obviously, that we're going to use is 45 mils, or what's that? An ounce and a half of amaretto. I love Disarono. Now the next ingredient that he uses is 22 and a half mils or three quarters of an ounce of a higher proof bourbon. Okay, now the reason that he does that is you really do want that bourbon to come through. We normally would add some bourbon to it, uh, but just normally a 40% ABV. I think that uh, Jeffrey uses the Bookers normally, really hard to get in Australia at the moment. So I'm going to use a 1776, which is a very delicious, bourbon as well and it sits at 50% ABV so it's it's enough to sort of really come through in this cocktail. Next up 30 mils or one ounce of freshly squeezed lemon juice then five mils just a touch of sugar syrup and last but not least 15 mils aquafaba here keeping it vegan and also uh, we like using aquafaba a lot here at the 18th Amendment Bar. Uh, it's, it's definitely economical and we don't get that sort of egg white smell that you get uh, when you use eggs. Now make sure that you dry shake this first. I'm really bad at remembering. Okay, what we're doing there is we just really want to emulsify that egg white or that aquafaba to get really nice and silky and create that nice froth on top. Then we'll add some ice. Got a good shake. All right. I'm actually really excited to drink this again. Okay, so we want to put that into a chilled glass. I don't really double strain uh, if it is a sour in a glass like this with over ice. Uh, if I was to make it, for example, in a coupette, I would double strain. So it sort of depends on you. Yum. I think it needs probably one more ice block for there. As far as garnish goes, I like orange with a maraschino cherry. And this is the world's best amaretto sour. Let's give it a try. Cheers, Mr. Morgenthaler. He's right. <laughs> um, that amaretto is coming through, obviously, uh, with the 45 mils, but the, the key for it, I think, is we really do want that nice flavour of the bourbon sort of punching through that normally gets hidden uh, behind the amaretto. It could probably be better if it was even like a cast strength, uh, but that, that is super tasty, delicious. It's a winner. We, we sell so many of these to customers now and they keep reordering, which is a great thing. Mmm. Absolutely delicious. Guys, please like, subscribe. See you again sooner. Let's talk drinks.